What's up guys, Kilsen here, and welcome back 10 years later in Raven Creek. So, I've packed up the truck with the essentials that we, we could need on the way over to the military outpost. We're going to be wasting no time. We've got water, food is in the truck, got this new Car 15 assault rifle, only has one magazine, but we've got extra ammo, so that's fine. Of course, we got the shotgun and the revolver, but yeah, let's waste no time. We're going to head over there and see what awaits us. I'm hoping for some good stuff. Of course, the sledgehammer is in the trunk. In case we need it. Looks like it's a straight shot. So let's get to it. Alrighty, looks like we've made it. Blood on the roads, corpses everywhere, zombies, a plenty. Let's stop the truck here. We've got some cleanup duty to get done to. Let's get the shotgun out. Ah, just wasted a shell on you. Alright, hear them behind me. Hey guys, how's it going? I think revolver might be better it's faster but they are also kind of surrounding me so let me just make sure i don't die by using the shotgun there we go and pop. i know wish this thing was a bit stronger but it is my best shotgun so far if we can find a spaz 12 that would be nice Triple, look at that. Oh uh, yeah, okay. Gotta be smart about this. Out of shotgun shells, I would have to open more boxes. Don't have time though, so we're just gonna use the revolver. Look at that, 45 ACP putting in work. Gotta love it. And of course, Aurora. She's putting in work as well. Can't forget her. Look at that. Clearing out the hordes. I knew I heard you. Zoom onto here. I think that's a good thing. Though. Zoom. Reload. We are good. Zoom out one more time, I think. I see you. There we go. Kind of running low. I'm going to have to open a box or two. I do plan on using the car 15 once we get inside, though. There we go. One more time. Get to open some boxes. Open this. Just to have it ready. I think the rest of my ammo is in the trunk. Okay, I think we're good with using the crowbar for now. Just like we thinned them out enough. How are we doing on stats? 751 Zeds killed. Weight is going down. One month, 11 days, one hour. Okay, here we go. Uh, Open... That one, and that one. Shotgun shells, do the same. Bam, and bam. I don't know what I'm running into in here, so I just want to be prepared. To tell you what, let's take one box of each. There we go. And then we'll favorite all of that. Nice. You know, let's favorite that as well, just in case. I don't want to lose that. And then, we load up. Machete. Please. Thank you. No, that's a machete. There we go. 
All right, let's head in here. See what we got. Got a big old grave site on the right here. It looks like if we're gonna get through the front, we might need the the sludgy. We can also just go on in on foot, just as, just to see what's up. So I think we'll do that. Looks like there, yeah, there is a hole right there we can go through. I wish we could read that sign, but that's the limitations of Zomboid. It's isometric. Can't read it. You're good to know those sandbags. Kind of lining all that. Okay, we're here. Let's see what's up. This place has seen better days, that's for sure. Just making sure I've got all my bases covered. I don't want to get jumped. Plenty of tents. I think we'll start over here. By these outhouses. Definitely got to clear out these trees. Hello, sir. Good night. Ooh, big. Real big. Tent thing. Let's see. Can I go through here? Ooh, military crates. I can go through here. What are these looking like? They're good, though. 65 space? I can take these. Let's just take it easy. Yep, that's what I mean. They can see me through these tent cover things. Military sweaters. Maybe your glasses already got that iron rodent. Take that. I don't know if I have that jacket already, but... It's good to have. Collector item. This looks like a... Office type place. Maybe like an HQ. Logistics bay or something. I'm guessing all these are going to be closed. Yeah, okay. I don't want to be here. Not yet. I don't need to be here. Yeah, let me just go out this way. Go out the front. Hello there. I'm here to steal all of the stuff here. Don't mind me. You don't need it, I'm sure. All these crates are empty. Okay. How's it going, guys? Plenty of crates and military barrels. Probably got some fuel in them. Well, I am reliably two shining these guys. That's great. I like that. I like it a lot. That's a three shot. Uh, well, win some, you lose some. I'm back up. There we go. Still got her munching down. Bye bye. Looks like we got a, like a mess hall or something down there. I really can't see a thing. Let's get back out to the main road. See what's going on in these tents, actually. Anything out here? No. I like the, the, the design on these tents, but... Definitely not safe. There we go. M24? Ooh. Okay. It's almost... Uh, well, I'm sure we'll find another one. Take the boxes of shotgun shells for now. Take these as well. Unload. There we go. Put those away. Do that? Okay, let's go. I'm trying to loot a little bit, but today's episode is more focused on just clearing this place out. I just want to see what we got. 1911... We could rock a 1911 later on, I think, instead of this revolver. They take the same ammo, just revolvers don't jam and such, so I wanted to use it. Hop over this. What do we got? I could start shooting just to get him out, but we're chilling right now. Let's just make our way down. There we go. Anything on you? No. I doubt I need any keys for here. This is all tents and stuff. It's all open. And if it isn't open, we got the sledgehammer. Yeah, that's the second part of it. Well, it might actually be just the exit. This why it's open though. That's good to see. Let's deal with you. 
she was going on down there. Lots of blood on the on the floor. A massacre happened here, and then they all rose back up, I guess. That's a wall of logs. That is sick. Yeah, that's the, uh, that's the exit right there. We'd have to break through here. Looks like they know I'm here. That looks important. Hmm. Okay, well, I'll we'll wait for them to break through that door. And we deal with anyone else. Could check out these tents. There's plenty of stuff to check out. But I think we'll go back at the sledgehammer and break through the wall here. Just so we have the truck. Because having that truck here as an escape route will be real nice. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the crowbars bite. Okay, let's get this truck more up and out of here. And get more visitors. Do this quickly. There we go. Leave it running. See if we can get some more charge in that battery. I did hit a few trees getting down here. I was just not paying attention, but that's the way it has to be. You can't you can't see all the trees. It just it just happens. Okay, let's put this in both hands. There we go. Start destroying these things. Go four wide just in case. There's somebody breaking through something. Might be in that little shack right there. Almost through. Just gotta watch out for the exertion. Yeah, they're in there. Okay, nice. We're through. Put this back in here. Have a little rest in the car. And then we'll continue on. Let me see food. Have some peas. I'll have to have some more food here. I do need more food. Could have brought more, but I didn't want to carry that much. I hear somebody. What's up in the wind? Let's get in here. Inside we go. Alright. And bop. Let's deal with this guy up here. Sounds like he's on, yeah, that window. How can I deal with you? I guess I would have to go through the door. Make sure my back is clear. Pry this open. We're in. Close that. What have we got in here? Ooh, a key. Yes. Another revolver. Don't exactly need that right now. We've got our own. Okay, let's see what's going on over here. Open area, shooting range. Whoa. Very cool. We got that whole place up there. Looks like a refugee camp or something. Probably nothing up there, though. Oh, we've got access to water? This is the first time I've seen the water. Very nice. Okay, there's a guy back there. I'm gonna give it a yell. Or a couple. Anything? I know you're back there. There you are. There we go. When it's clear. I did add two more mods since the last episode that changed the satchels and backpacks into more fitting versions for the 10 years later mod. They look very sick so far. I hope they all work together with all the mods I have. They seem to be working together. No errors yet. But we'll just have to wait and see. Anything in these? Paperclip. Red paint. That's good to know. More barracks to look like. Let's go through the front door. Just to make sure we're fine and dandy and safe and sound. So that we don't get jumped. Ear pro. 
Yeah, just army stuff, Air Force coveralls and such. But this, tactical, oh, it's almost broken. Two shotguns, nice, take the 45 and the shotgun shells. M16 mag, I need that. Fill that up right now. Alright, we got two mags for the assault rifle. Let's see. Anything that have ammo? Yep. Okay, unload this one. You give me that. There we go. Yep, I'm definitely gonna have to spend some time here sorting out all the loot. Let's see what's in this one. Crates? Nothing. Seems like they leave the guns in the far back one. Yep, another M16 mag, nice. They're giving me all the good stuff. How much does that carry? Okay, that's full. Cool. Oh. Okay, time to get out. Hey, yep. I know there's another one. There you are. That's what I mean, you gotta be on your toes, head on a swivel, keep your eyes peeled and all that. Let's see what we got back here. Looks like radio shacks. Oh, they do have this, what's in here? More ammo. Another M16 mag. I will take it. Okay. Nice. Let's put some of this in the car. I will favorite these two magazines. I don't need more than three. At least I don't think I do. Hit back up here. Put all this away. There we go. Make sure we're good. We are... Okay. Yeah. Tell you what, let's try this. Equip. Uh oh. Just one. We're good. Okay, I want to put this on the back. There we go. Just in case we need it. Looks like we got some company. There we go. They're trying to speak to me, but I will not falter. Hey, how's it going? Down the four wheel. Okay, we gotta break through that other side. Over here. Looks like they did it for me though. Thank you. Gotta get in here as well. Anything for me? Nope. Here's some planks. Nothing. These nice crates though. Right, I'm gonna shoot you because I don't trust that at all. And now I really gotta manage what's on my back. Put that back on the sling. There we go. Cool. Okay, let's put out the revolver. Reload that. And then equip both hands. Very nice. Okay, that's how it's barricaded. I don't need to worry too much about that. Let's head into here. See what we got. I hear you. I got another side of that. Okay. This is kind of sketch. It's locked. Okay. They got to break that down for me. Because I am not going over there. Make sure we're good. I don't want to spend the night here. But if I have to, I will. Speed this up. There we go. But I don't really know where we could spend the night if we do. Maybe in one of these. Those are pretty safe. But if they see me in there, I'm kind of kind of screwed. Even though, well, I mean, I do have three guns on me. I'd probably be safe. And if I can get... Oh, those? These might be storage crates. That might work. Sleep in one of them. Not going to be comfy. It's going to be cold. But it's nothing the war can't handle. Is our storage crate? Ooh. 
That could be something. Hello, sir. Ponytail. There we go. Goodbye. Helipad. Cool. Hear you banging over here. How oh, you're on this one? Hello. How's it going? I can deal with you. As long as there's no one else like that. Alright, let's go in. Deal with this guy. Seems like there might be guns in there. Guns and ammo. What have we got? Double holster. Ah, I already got one. What about this one? Five or six, I'll take. You guys get out. I heard you. Come on out. That's a medical crate. There's a bunch of stuff here. There you are. Nothing on you. I can hear quite a few. Look through the window first. Yeah, they're coming out. Come get me. How many are in here? Back off. Okay, I was kind of afraid there would be like 20 of them just in here. But looks like we're good. Come on. There you go. Everything's fine. Lots of cool medical equipment in here we could steal for the, a base later on. I do want to turn that factory into a base. That is definitely something I want to do. Take all that. Bunch of cots, of course. Cots are very nice for deployable beds. But of course, we got the sleeping bag, so it kind of doesn't matter. Alright, crate number one. Looks like a medical crate. Yeah, just some hospital stuff. Nothing I need. Well, okay. Let's go up here. Check out what this is. And then I want to go backtrack over to the mess hall or whatever that was. That cafeteria looking building. This doesn't look like much, but there could be something back here. 556, five, I'll take. Someone's munching down. Get out before something happens. Oh, you're going in. Hey, close one. That could have been dead. Come on. Knife him back, man. Looks like a bread knife. Let me just check. Butter knife. Same thing. Alright, who's munching down? I don't hear them no more. Maybe he's one of these guys in there. No, it's somebody else. Oh, right there. Okay. Hello. Good to see you. I do want to use this assault rifle. It's just... There's not many Zeds to use it. They're all scattered out. Where's the door at? I forgot what the door is. It's down here. Let's use the auto walk. There we go. Bye bye. Your head is gone. Okay. Let's see. Got the big old tent down there. Let's backtrack. Put all this stuff away. Wait, where are we? Oh. We went through the wall. This is the wrong side. Hmm. Good to know. Alright, let's see. They are gonna keep on repopulating because of all the corpses. They want to eat their fellow zombies, but that helps me out. Clears out the area more. Alright, let's get in here. Transfer. There we go. And the mess hall thing was down here. Bunch of trees. Okay. Let's take it slow. Slowish. Not too slow. Just slow enough. That is too thick of a forest. Let's go around. This way is good. Alright, what have we got down here? Is there a hole in the fence? Can't tell. 
Back up a little bit. Oh, there's a hole. Okay. They're coming in from the trees. I think one more's coming. Yeah. You two are eating. Don't have to worry about you. Let's deal with this guy. Howdy fellas, how's it going? Kind of fitting that they're eating a corpse at the the cafeteria here. A little bit ironic, I guess. US Army property, this is all gonna be spoiled if there's anything. There's nothing. Yeah, it's all spoiled off. Reduced to atoms. The ants took it. This could be good though. That's their storage room for food. I just don't like how close this is. We have to do it though. Gotta send it. Ooh, nice. A storage room. Nope. Oh yeah, okay. We're good. We got food. Lentils. I'm looking for canned stuff. There we go. Don't want any of the tea. Don't need it. Rock candy. Let's eat that now. Uh oh. Time to get out. Get out of the trees. Okay, good. He went to the window. Not two of them. Do both of you. Oh, we're drowsy. Already. Probably because of that sledgehammer. Tell you what, I'm going to set the alarm to 10. Because I feel like she's not getting enough sleep. There we go. Because I don't have the wakeful trait or anything, I don't think, no. So she's not getting enough sleep. Let's see, we gotta start heading back. Where's the truck? There it is, okay. Uh, I could spend the night here. I don't think I will though. It's not safe yet, I don't want to risk that. But, I'm gonna end this episode here. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I have. Next episode, we're going to go explore more of this place, open it up more, kill some more Zeds, and get our way through that barricade at the other side. But if you like this type of stuff and you want to see more, make sure you hit that like button down below, and consider hitting that subscribe button as well. We are on the road to 1,000 subs. We're almost at 800. And I'll see you guys in the next one. As, as always, thanks to the channel members for your support, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.